limitations on what we do and how we behave. Yes, Rabia? Uh, we have to be sidelined. Why? Uh, because uh, Miss, uh, you are taking the group. uh, groups in there and you are talking about what we are doing. Mm -hmm. And uh, one here, um, uh, when all body is saying blah, 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 blah you can't, uh, we can't hear what you are saying in there. Exactly, thank you. I need to be able to talk with my groups and hear my groups. Yes, Alia. Mm -hmm. We also have to be independent as this is uh, our difference, not the other people. So we have to do it on our own. Right, so this is independent. We do a lot of group work in this class, a lot of group work. But this is one thing that you guys are expected to do by yourself. And um, one of the reasons is, are all the activities, are you guys doing all the same thing in every single packet? No, it's all different for, because you're different people. And please read the title, Rabia. Yay, Anna and the Magic Coat. Okay, so that's what you guys are reading this week, Anna and the Magic Coat. Yes? Uh, this Magic Coat is a tree. Ah, so you are doing exactly what we are going to do which we are going to use our reading strategies. Oh. Which one did you just use? Um, uh, what did you just do? You asked a question. Yes, so questioning, Benjamin, is one of our reading strategies. So let's look at this cover and ask other questions. So you asked if um, a magic coat was a tree? Yep. Why did you ask that? Um, because in the cover, a little girl or a girl mm -hmm. is looking a tree. Uh, maybe it's a tree, or maybe it's another tree. <laughs> okay, Benjamin, what do you think? Mm -hmm. Look at the picture on the cover. Do you have any? Why is she? No, I don't. You just said why. What do you know? Why is the girl doing like this? Why is she doing that? That's a good question. So that's our questioning. We're going to think about why is she pointing to the tree? Is it about a tree, right? Yeah. And why, uh, mm -hmm. and, the, and why there is a, a man, a man behind the tree? Mm -hmm. Ah. Oh. Yes. yes. Good. Noticing the cover. Why is there a man behind the tree? And the man is wearing something. Rabia, do you know what they're wearing? Um. I know Turkish. Uh, but. Mm. You know, I told you guys to grab them a second ago when we went outside. I said, get your coat. coat. Or uh, my sister has, uh, she, uh, she has, maybe, uh, jacket? Okay, well, um, we just brought up the vocabulary, Rabia, that this is a coat. Yep. So, reading the title again. Oh, oh coat. Cool. Yes, yes. so, coat. which thing is magic on here coat. now, do you think? Coat. Probably the coat. All right, so let's read some pages. Oh, Anna and the Magic Coat. Coat. Written by Ruth Sibert, illustrated by Joel Snyder. Well, we should start at the beginning, which is page three. Mm -hmm. So, um... Hang on a second. So we're also using our other strategies, like making connections. Mm -hmm. So when I read this title, I remember a book that I read about um, a boy that found a magic ring. And uh, in that book, he made a lot of wishes on this ring, but it actually caused him a lot of trouble. So I'm wondering if this book with the magic coat is gonna be kind of like the boy with the magic ring. So I'm wondering if it's going to get her in trouble in the same way. Do you guys have any connections with what you see on the cover? My own name is Okay. You guys have never read or seen a story about something magical? I see. I, 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 I read. What did you read? Magic Goldfish. Okay. Well, there we go. Did you ever read or see a story? I read Magic Goldfish. Ah, okay. 
So let's read the first couple pages. Who wants to read the first one? Okay, go for it, Rabia. I know looks out her great words were new as dark clouds and pearls up, up in the sky. I hope it doesn't rain, Oma. What do you say, Oma? Well, look at the picture. Can you guess what, who or what Oma might be? Um, a girl, maybe. Okay, well, let's keep reading and maybe we can figure it out. Anna said, uh, remember that Opa told what? Remember uh, what? Remember what Opa told you? Oma said, a little rain makes all things better. Not school uh, picnics, said Anna. Okay, so there's two people talking on this page. Who are the two people talking about? Maybe Amma's grandmother and the uncle. Yes. And the little brother. Uh oh, are there three people talking? No. Okay, Anna so there's Anna and two. his grandmother. Anna and her grandmother. Mm -hmm. So who is Oma? Oma? Uh, maybe her grandmother's thing? Maybe, yeah. Alright, Benjamin, it's your turn. True, Oma not the thing and Things are not so good. Anna looked at the box of cupcakes with pink eyes. I said, Oma and Anna had worked hard on them. Rain is not good of cu for cupcakes, either, said either. Anna. Either. Okay, so they want to go on a picnic, mm -hmm. but it's rainy. Do you, yes? So they, I have a question. <laughs> uh, I have a connection. Mm -hmm. When I were in the mm -hmm. pre K or in You're gonna make one too, I think. So on first grade, we were going to a picnic and it was so rainy and we make it in inside. Oh, so maybe that'll happen in this story. If it's too rainy to have a picnic, maybe we'll have it inside. Do you have a connection? No. Have you ever been on a picnic? Yes, I did. 